Welcome to Synthetic Oil Protection. What are we here doing? I don't even know what we're doing, but I'm holding some oil. Some 040 oil signature. And it's going in this Hellcat. The first Hellcat on the channel, thanks to a good man, Kevin, donated this little angel. And uh, it's going to be neat to see how she sounds. But uh, first, we got Hamlet. He's going to be putting in the engine flush. We're going to be kicking it off with our fast funnel. Let's do it. It's the first time I'm seeing the fast funnel work in person. And you see that little thin detergent go in. It's like a very, very thin, thin detergent. Oh, he missed for a sec. It's okay. It's okay. We're still breaking him in. Now, if you don't know, you're new to the channel. Uh, Hamlet is a new dealer. He's getting really used to all the products. And, uh, well, you're going to be seeing a flush on... Uh, God, this is the, the nicest looking uh, charger... Uh, Challenger I've seen on the channel so far those wheels are a killer so here we go all right Hamlet's gonna motor up we're gonna let her idle for 15 minutes If you're new to the channel, definitely subscribe. All you do is just tap the button right here, and then you'll see the notification bell. Tap that, and that way you'll be notified when we post a new video later. The Dominator. 10 millimeter bolts off for the little belly pan. Got Hamlet down there in the dungeons, getting ready to crack her loose. How many mil socket is it? 13 mil. 13 mil socket, real easy to get to. Huge belly pan, or uh, should I say oil pan, pretty easy to get to. And that's it. We're gonna see the liquid gold flow, the liquid chocolate. <laughs> Beautiful, look at that. Comes out like a damn waterfall. All right, we're gonna let her drain down. All seven quarts. I think it's seven quarts, right? Seven quarts. I think it's seven quarts, yeah. Seven quarts coming out. Soon to be seven to coming in. In there a little bit. But you can get to it pretty good. Yeah, that's going to want the pliers. Yep. We're going to get the pliers to yank her off. 4700 RPM at the plant. Yeah. And now I got more power. Now I fucking turn everything. Even with the 15s, I'm turning everything down because I got too much power now to the ground. Yeah. All right. Even though I built my suspension already too. I want a turbo car for that. We're gonna yank off our oil filter. There it is, right there. Got the old vice grips. No hard, hard. I had to get it off. Wow. Filter was on so hard. Grab it, and you're cracking it. It's all twisted. bent. Yeah, it's all bent and leaking. And if you didn't squeeze it that hard, it wouldn't twist. Wow. So that's why it's good to do your own oil changes, because you know what you're putting on. Nothing like the satisfaction of doing your own oil change. Ah, look at that. Beautiful, giving boyth to an oil filter. Let her drain a little bit. He's got some heavy duty rubbers on, which is good. That'll keep you protected, keep the engine flush off your skin. You gotta go to Man, I wonder how this would shift with the good trans fluid. I bet it would be a different car. Yeah. This thing would shift so good. Oh my God. All right, there she blows. So you see that nice clean housing, the oil's super thin. And uh, that's pretty much it. Time to prep our oil filter. Look at that thing run. That's beautiful. You can see the oil's just dripping out of the pan like water. All right.
right, it's that time for our oil filter. This is a one year, 25,000 mile oil filter. Now we're only gonna be running about 12 to 15. This is a severe service car. And I'll show you how she comes in a nice package. And it filters at 99% efficiency. So Hamlet, show them what that looks like. Come right up to the camera, right about here. Up higher, 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 higher. And show them the inside of that filter. Yep, so that's what it looks like inside. You'll see the threads. And uh, it's like a little cheapy and show them how soft it is, show them how it bent. And uh, now we're gonna show you the AMSO filter kind of side by side. I'm gonna go ahead and just poke her in here. Oh. And this is the, uh, the nice coating to it. So it's like a grippy coating. It's a lot thicker. And then you'll see the back plate thickness. Just hold that up a little higher, side by side right here. A little higher right there. You'll see the back plate thickness, and then the anti-drain back valve is a lot thicker, and it's silicone, softer, and it doesn't deform with heat, so it doesn't allow the oil to drain back out over the course of the year. So a huge upgrade, and then the thickness of the medium is a lot more. So I know that looks like the wrong filter, but it's actually the right one. Um, this is just a cheapie you get at one of those oil change places. So uh, that's the benefits of uh, doing your own oil. So well, let's go ahead and uh, get her nice and wet. All right, we're putting in the liquid gold. Ah, and you almost got to get quiet. It's so delicate. And uh, you just kind of take your time. It's saturating the medium. And then you come with two finger. You can keep going a little more. And I'll come with two finger. And we'll get her nice and wet. So she slips on like butter. And that's how you know we're uh, always protected. Because as you know, the wetter the better. Good. All right, we have some new profound discoveries to share with you, uh, the channel. We really appreciate you watching these videos. Now, Hamlet's, he's brought me up to date on something he's found. You left the car sit overnight, yeah. and another how many ounces of oil do you think came out by letting it drain? I would say at least half a quart. Half a quart of oil, all right. So now you'll see how many minutes has this thing been dripping now, would you say? Uh, 25 maybe? It's been dripping for, yeah, good 20 minutes. And you can see it's still dripping. And the flush really, really, really thins it out. You can see it splashing on that in the pan, so it's still coming out. My so, observation is everything from the top is just slowly melting to coming down. That's beautiful. So yeah, so what we'll do is uh, We'll, uh, we'll do a video coming up soon, how much more comes out of your engine when you do an engine flush. And we'll do an hour, and put your funnel on it, and see how much it goes up the port. Yeah, we'll do it, we'll do a 24 hour one. All right, we'll see ya. We had a small accident, a very, very, very small accident. Uh-oh. Hamlet's dumping the old oil out, and it looks pretty dark. I mean, there was a lot of stuff that came out of that oil. A lot of carbon deposits. So uh, it's gonna be neat to see what she sounds like. All right, it's that time to feel her up. Hamlet's got the honors of putting it in, and you'll see that beautiful liquid gold. And I'll show you, give you a close up. Look at that. It's like pouring honey on pancakes. Look at that. Oh yeah. Beautiful. And it's so good, you can even feel the protection. And uh, well, you're gonna hear it in a, in, a, in a second. So Hamlet's just finishing putting the seven quarts of the liquid gold in. Now this is 100% synthetic, so it's got no impurities and uh, it's just like, it's almost like being in church. It's so beautiful. You just, you can talk quiet and just keep doing your work. No, this is way better than being in church, right, Hamlet? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm just joking around. I'm being an idiot. But yeah, this stuff burns off at half the rate of Mobile One Extended Performance. We'll stick all that data down in the description section. And it, uh, it burns uh, with the turbo coking test one-fourth of that mobile one. So they actually do a test where they measure the carbon deposits, especially with turbo, supercharged cars. They have tons and tons of heat, oil cooler ports. Well, that's about one fourth of the carbon of mobile one extended performance. 
and we'll pass the golden torch. He's putting in uh, second to last. So if you love your car, if you do, if you love it, this is what you do to it. It's gonna happen, our first startup with Amsoil. Kevin, come out and listen after. gonna check the oil level here and it officially takes about 10 minutes for it to drain down so we're gonna empty yep because uh he's right on empty yep and uh the oil actually clings to the metal a lot better so it just really grabs and adheres to the metal and that's kind of what the difference is because when you cold start the very next day you have the film from the previous time you ran it plus you got the better oil filter and uh God, 80% of the wear on an engine is during a cold start, so yeah, that's the secret. the Dominator coolant boost, so yep. cold starts way quicker, five minutes off the time, usually 10 minutes in the winter, now five minutes, AC, the heater's got the windows defrosted. Beautiful. All right, so if you're new to the channel, definitely subscribe, tap the notification bell, that way you can come back and watch loads of this stuff later. I mean loads later. And uh, if you are new and you don't know, Leave a comment within the first 30 minutes, and that's how you get into my end of month giveaway. So we give all kinds of $100 gift cards away, stuff like that. Hamlet's holding the badge of honor, and he's gonna be placing the badge of honor. This is, uh, it's like a sacred ceremony. Look at that. Just look at the way that sticker's gonna look there. Amazing. Beautiful. It's like an artist. It's officially AMS oiled. Things whisper quiet. Oh my God. Beautiful. Beautiful. So there'll be more to come. So uh, definitely subscribe. There's going to be a lot more great action on these cars, and uh, oh, it's beautiful. Hamlet said, "Get both of them together." Yes, they are together. Thanks, man. Thank you. Yep. We'll see ya. Thanks. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, that's a dream. So yeah, so Hamlet's uh, doing a lot of great, great things with the helping out with the channel. And if you're new to the channel, definitely subscribe and check out how all his info is in the uh, description section below. If you're into racing, reach out to him. That's what he does. Always there for any help. Yeah, yeah. So uh, we'll see you back. Oh, and check out all the videos on Hamlet's car. We'll stick that right here in the middle. We're gonna go ahead and put that playlist right here. All right. We'll see you back. See ya. Cheers to protection, protection, protection.